what's up guys welcome to another video <clears throat> it's gonna be a quick one i'm just gonna do work on the door pillars um so this is one of the other common issues on these jetters see this is the jetter um what's gonna happen what happens now sometimes this gets sun faded and then it looks old so what i did initially i wrapped it in some black gloss um vinyl wrap wherever i'm seeing some imperfections as you can see it um imperfections in the wrap that's i guess it came from here so it doesn't really look that good and i had the spare time and like the car look good as possible so i'm gonna replace it as you see i already removed this um vinyl in here um this was like this so get the new stuff i'm gonna show you what i got off ebay so what I got off eBay was was this. Basically, it's like a a sticker, and it just sticks on, and it comes like this. I already did. So basically, it's like a six um, piece set. I already did the other side. I'll show you in a minute. Um, so basically, it comes like this. Also comes with this included. This part right here, which I find is um, very cool too. So in all this is gonna be like gloss black. It has a protective flame over it, so that's why it looks so pale, but it's gonna look good. I'm gonna show you the next side and see how it looks. I already did it before. This is the other side. I already done it before, and this is how it came out. See how you can see my reflection in it? That's how glossy it is and how clean it is. Pretty much when the car looks, you know, pretty much new as from a distance. The reflection is just good. A little like bumps and stuff in here but that's okay um also did this part as well too you can see good so i'm gonna do the next side and show you the process that i did for this side see looks pretty clean right see the reflection in it so i'm gonna show you the next side so what i did the other side i removed the old um vinyl that was on it i didn't want to you know, have double vinyl on it so I just took a blade and just cut it off and edges. And I may need the edges you know, just, just to make it look good, but I just took a blade and just cut off like a, a box and then try to remove the old vinyl. It came out pretty good. So if you don't have vinyl, then you don't need to do this. So I wouldn't show much of it. Okay, so I removed the old wrap. Uh, as you can see, um, you know it's kind of messed up that's why i was showing through the paint i try to sandpaper it before i place the um the, the gloss black wrap as you can see this messed it up however you know i got this now so this should you know fix it make it look a little better before i do all that um i want to clean this up so i'm going to use some glass cleaner and then some ibuprofen alcohol and wipe this down and then get the this is a sticker so basically it's backing on and then you want to take this and stick it on and yeah so i'm going to clean it for you guys and show you so i just take some glass cleaner at first and just using this because it's non strict free and it cleans as much as i can this i'm going to wipe it down also don't forget this pad as well yeah so it's dirty i'm going to get all the dirt off i'm going to get some alcohol in it and then wipe it down a clean surface so this part's pretty long so i'm gonna cut a little bit out of it just so that top of it lines up with the top and it's not you know um bulgy on the outside so this is that side see i'm showing again i just want to cut um a piece because i want it to just lie right like this and I wanted to go too much on top, so I'm gonna cut a piece off at the bottom. Cause now that we got it cut, see I just cut like a small piece of it at the bottom, right here. And now it just lines up, and now I can just place it in. The trick is now to actually get a line, so your door seams, you know, looks um, OE original. And uh, yeah, so you gotta get lined up like that and then remove the sticker and just place it on. What I did, um, I just placed the top in. Now I'm gonna remove the peeling and then slowly 
um, glide it down to the end and try to keep that seam straight as possible. So we're trying to keep that um, apart so we can get this straight. So as you can see, I'm almost at the end. I'm just slowly pulling down the um, backing and then try to get this uh, line up. Yeah, so that was it. Now you want to tap it down. Now the good thing about this vinyl is that um, this has a protecting over it, so that's why it looks dull um, right now. But I'm gonna show you how it is after I remove the liner top of it. Okay, so I'm gonna remove the liner and show you how glossy it actually looks. This is a protective arm um, covering. So I'm gonna put this back off. Got it like that, and then you just wanna see what's happen. See how, yeah, that's the glass we're talking about. And so there, we just fixed our door pillar by this simple little hack, or oh, hack, but now it looks 10 times way better. We'll do this side, and this side, and then we should be done. See how it looks, guys? This is, this is way better than the vinyl wrap because the vinyl wrap, you have to remove the actual um, door if you wanna get it curved like this, or you can just heat wrap and shrink, but I find this looks way better and with no dents and stuff that's behind it. So it looks way 10 times better than anything um, that the vinyl wrap is done. Going to this side as well, gonna cut it. Um, gonna cut the bottom as well. You can see it's too tall. It's too tall, so we're gonna cut the bottom, the excess, just by this tiny little bit. And then it should be good. So this is pretty much the back end. It's pretty much like very sticky. It's not free or anything, but it should hold until the lifetime of the car. Okay, so we got this side too, um, all set. I'll just remove the back end. Yeah, look at that. Looks so good. Gap is clean. Everything is good. Now I'm gonna just pass it right over here. This side's pretty easy, so just um, send it in a cut so you can actually just write it down and then slides right in. There we go. So you got this piece in and then just remove the protective frame of it. And this should just come out looking good. Yeah, very, very good. Clean. Clean as well. Spotless, you can see markings and nothing in it so job well done like this video please like and subscribe 